Gentlemen, welcome back to the shop and welcome back to tonight's little shop project. Well, tonight's our shop project is not really a project, it's more of a proof of concept. What I've got here is two four inch PVC pipe. Now let me just check the wall thickness, it's normal train pipe. Uh, looks like about 3.2 millimeters. Now, every so often I need some plastic to do something and I need sheets a lot of the time. So what I'm going to do try is flatten these out to a sheet that we can work with. Now I've seen guys shape PVC with a heat gun so I don't think we're going to get it, need to get it too hot but uh, let's see the internet says about 70 plus degrees so we're going to try and bend this, uh, straighten it out rather bend, not bend and mold, straighten it out using uh, boiling water. Gives us about 98 degrees uh, up here where we are at our altitude. So let's see what we can get into. First of all, I've already marked it out. I'm just going to cut it so that we can get a line to split it on. And there we go. Uh, now just a little quick clean up with some acetone and then we will hijack the lady of the house's kitchen and see if we can get these back. So I've got this old baking tray that I've got that we had lying around here. Uh, got it onto the stove, got it heated up, the water's just starting to boil now. So what we're going to do is we're going to put our PVC in there and start heating it up. It might take a while. As you can see already there's something moving here on the corner. It might not take as long as we thought. Just be careful not to burn yourself. So while this is cooking away a bit, uh, I'm just going to move the camera, oh, my apologies, but to the side. We can start with the second part of the process. I've got this baking sheet, uh, you can, some of you guys might remember it from a previous video that I made, uh, that I'm just going to put a piece of wax wrap on. Yeah, so that if there's any weird stuff sticking or whatever, it will not, hopefully not stick to the wax wrap. Okay, now that we've got this fairly soft, the ends are still rock hard. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to take this one out, place it on the baking sheet, and then I am going to put... Ah! The... baking sheet on top of the roasting tray on top of it. Right, now we have to move this whole thing into the oven. Which is, no, I think, I think, I think this is going to be where I actually burn myself. We'll make a plan now. We'll be back in a second. Okay, so what I've decided to do is I've put another sheet of wax wrap in between. I've got it on the baking sheet. Then I've put another thin smaller baking sheet on top of that and we will put our weight which is the water on top of that. So this top one is purely going to act as a weight. Let me just see if we've got everything right here. I think it'll do. Now I'm going to carefully slide this back in there. I'm trying not to burn myself. There we go. 
and now we are going to put the oven on 100 degrees maybe 120 and uh, just let it be for a while Okay, so we got the whole thing up to about 100 degrees. Uh, it's been in the oven for about 45 minutes, but we are on thin ice. The lady of the house is making dinner in the background, and she promised me the last time that if I ever make the house smell like burnt plastic again, she's going to rip off my arm and slap me with a wet end. So it's completely settled now. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to turn the oven off and let it cool down, and then we'll see what we can get out of it. Okay, so there we have it. Uh, ended a little bit prematurely. I got chased out of the kitchen again. Not due to the smell, but because I was in the way. Uh, this is the second one that I did now. You'll see it didn't get, it didn't come out completely flat. Uh, I think I could have left it on the heat a little bit longer. But nonetheless, came out more than, better than expected. Uh, this is actually the first one I overheated this one a little bit. I got uh, a bit carried away turned up the oven and didn't come out as nice in terms of finish got a bit scorched but it's much flatter so we'll be playing around uh, on it um, like I say just a quick little video showing you what can be done uh, I think this was a huge success look for a future video where I'll be using this for some other project and uh, I think I'm gonna wrap it up here as always please rate comment subscribe and as always, stay safe.